Hi everyone, I hope you have enjoyed my speaking session at the 99.co and Sydney event at HDB Hub Auditorium on the 7th of October. What la? For those people who didn't come, hi, you have missed out so many of my jokes. First time here we talk. Oh, sorry, I did not go like. Today's session, I will be touching something different. I have someone who came to me directly for one-to-one -one consultation and he shared that he has sold his flat, he has a place to stay and he wants to buy an investment property. His budget is about 1.5 million and then his good friend who is an agent recommended him this property. And once I heard this project, it's like, Ayo! Is this your friend or frenemy? Everyone here who is watching this video, you know that this channel is to be a giant hua kui through buying property and building your portfolio. So if you buy the wrong project, it's like punching your hua kui over and over again. Then how to build bigger? So this video will be something special. I'll be touching what are the projects that you should totally avoid. So guys, if you really want to be a Huawei and don't want to make any mistakes, you better subscribe to my YouTube channel now and build your Huawei together with me. Let's go. First of all, agents are supposed to market all the project new launches because they are the marketing agencies. However, I felt that yala, you can sell anything, but make sure you do your due diligence. La. You know that some project before you buy, you lose money already, ma. And this person who came to me for consultation told me this agent is a friend recommended this project. If you tell me the agent is someone who is stationed at the show flat telling you all the good points about this project, that's totally fine. In this video, I'm going to share with you five projects that if your Asian friends ask you to buy, you better run as far as possible and delete them from your contact list. So the first property, every time I heard of this name, Pumen. Uh, Once I heard this word, oh, lama, why, be, why your friend recommend? Come on, at 1.5 million budget, what can you buy at Pumen? One better lah. Guys, if you know my pattern now, you know that I am not a fan of core region. I like OCR, I like City Fish Bed because there's a lot of demand. So 1.5 million. You buy Pullman. So what is the per square feet? Let me show you now. Pullman. Okay, Pullman Residences and Newton. 340 units, free home. Wow, you can see that recently somebody bought the one beta. 3,004 per square feet, nearly 1.6 million. Let's continue to look at the Pullman Residences transactions. Okay, the latest one. This one should be three beta. 3,004 per square feet as well. 4 million eh. 4 million? Oh. I hope you make money now. Oh. Ah, so you see another one beta sold for 1.6 million. This one should be two beta, 2.2 million. So for the one beta, you buy with 3,004 per square feet. And because it's a small unit, you need to make at least four, 500 per square feet in order to make a good, decent profit. Ma. Will you be able to sell at 3,008, 3,009 per square feet? three years later. So even you sell at 3,008, 400 per square feet times 400 over per square feet, you should make a decent profit of about 180, 190,000. Will there be a high or tai how to buy from you or not? Always ask yourself about the exit strategy. So if you don't have the confidence, then you don't buy such a high entry level property. La. But again, I hope I'm wrong. I hope everyone make money. But at 3,004, when your entry price is so high, can you sell or not? And the easiest way to do some due diligence is go and check out what is the maybe the latest new launch which is sold previously before this project. So a quick one I can think of is 26 Newton. So let's check out the performance. It's free hole, completed in 216. That means it's seven years old. Ay yo, there's only two transactions. Le. When you see no transaction, that means no demand, no people want to buy. La. Like that, how to make money. So I hope that these two transactions make money. Ah. Just note that the latest one is 22nd floor and 13th floor. Profitable transaction only got one. It is not the latest transaction. 
and this person made 38,000. You haven't minus all the cost. And if you tell people you make money, uh, you go home, uh, your mother kick you out. Uh. And now let's look at the unprofitable transactions. What wow, eh, there are five. Leh. The latest two transactions lost 100,000, lost 50,000. And guys, in the year 2017, you buy some more how the property project, you make until sell. Eh. So once you see this kind of results, you still want to buy at this area at 3,004 to 3,005 per square feet, man. So once you have any Asian friends that recommend this project, you better run and delete them immediately. Uh. The second project, if any of your friends as an Asian want to recommend this, you also delete them from Facebook and delete their contact list. Uh. Never see them and meet them again. Hey, wait, wait, wait. There are good agents. There are good ones who recommend very good properties. The second project, what allow you buy in, uh, I also hope you make money, uh, is One Burnham. I did a review about two years ago on One Burnham. If you haven't watched, go and watch. Uh, I put the link at the top. You can click somewhere here. The title I really should put as One Burnham or One Burden. And you still go and buy. Uh. I really clap for you. Uh. I really hope you make money. Uh, huh? Go and look at the review. Uh, because I shared a lot of comparison why I felt that buying into One Burnham is very hard to exit because one of the biggest buyer or I feel that the, one of the biggest buyer who, uh, who are attracted to CBD properties, they are, you know what? And now they kena 60% ABSD, how to buy, how to sell. Every time you feel that the exit is, ah, you don't have confidence, then of course don't buy lah. Everyone, buying into CBD is not cheap leh. It's not that you buy something, ah, yeah, lose money, ne never mind. It's not cheap. So that's the reason these kind of places, there are some areas, some projects, never touch guys. Don't be stubborn, don't buy because I have seen people lose a lot of money. Lose a leg, lose a hand, go home, the father kick him out of the house. So if you don't want this to happen, you want to build your hardware bigger, bigger, uh, you please follow the right people. Me la, how you say? <laughs> okay, he just bathed. You just bathed, right? Xiang Xiang. Mmm, smells so good. So, everyone, Bomb Bomb also wants to buy property as soon as possible. So, be like Bomb Bomb. Remember to subscribe to the YouTube video. Mwah. Okay? Okay, number three. I also did a review for this before, which I also think you it's hard to make money, it's hard to exit. It is the landmark. After so many years, there are still available units. What can you tell about the project? It's a common sense. Developer built the beautiful show flat, paid agent fees, did a lot of marketing in order to sell. And yet, some of the projects can't move. So what makes you think that after you buy, you can sell? Are you going to build a show flat? Are you going to pay agent fee 10% to sell a place? No ma. So guys, don't anyhow buy property. I did a review for Landmark a few years ago. You can check it out. I will just put the, the link somewhere here. You can click and watch. Lah. Number four, the missing walk hey. TMW. I have did the review. You can watch the review. I've really shared that buying into this area, you can't make your pot of gold after three years. One of the easiest way is to check out what is the percentage sold on launch day. PMW Maxwell sold seven units, average at 3,003 per square feet. 3,003 leh. 三千三 leh. 不是三块三 leh, 朋友. So seven units out of 324 units. What's the percentage ah? T divided by 三二四. It is... 2.16% I am very sad for these 7 buyers eh. You better hope that you still have more neighbors ah. If not ah, I do not know who will buy and become your neighbor eh. Then I very capo eh. I go and check out Is there really 7 buyers or not? The missing walkway eh? 324 units They launched in August 12th There are only 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 6 Transaction not seven. That means one of them pull out lah. And from August 12th to today, it's already two months, they only moved six units. 
6 divided by 3, 2, 4. Which means they only move 1.85%. The 6 of you, I confirm that you are not my subscriber. And I really wish you well and hopefully 3 years later, you can sell 4,000 per square feet. Number 5. If your agent friend asks you to buy, you better run away. Yeah? Or if my member tell me, Eric, uh, before I come and see you, uh, uh, we have bought this from my, our friend. Uh, Tara Hill. What are we? I do not know how to help you. Eh. Tara Hill. Okay, free hole. Wow. Did you see what I saw? Don't know if giant hua or giant chai hui. <laughs> chai hui. 1009 level 3 eh. Square feet bought 2008 la. 5.34 million la. At Pase Panjang la. You can buy semi D eh. Let's continue to see the other transaction. Oh lao eh. Oh lao eh. Uh, 2007 per square feet ah. Why yo. Can you sell 3000 per square feet la? Wow everyone I do this video ah. I hate it eh. If you have bought this, please don't come and look for me. Uh. Wow, wow. It's my responsibility to help you make money. Eh. Once I see this, uh, I do not know how to help you again. Eh. Two plus million budget got a lot of good things to buy. Eh. You don't need to buy a new launch at the, this location. Uh. Don't need to talk about the five plus million. Uh. This person too rich. Uh, don't need any advice. one. And I hope that all these people who buy into this project, it will be a giant work rate in three years. Hey everyone, suddenly I have a bonus. This five project uh, is not too bad eh? because this last project is the worst of all and you can't guess it correctly or not. It suddenly comes to my mind. It is people who promote and recommend overseas property. Ayah. Hey, come on guys. Everyone, I am a very logical person. If the overseas project is so high and so good, what now? I come on, the locals will buy all. You think you have a chance as a foreigner to buy, man? No lah. It's only the locals, they themselves feel that, ah yeah, at this price point, I don't want to buy. At this kind of location, I don't want to buy. Then they bring to the what country like Singapore to sell to a high like you lah. And if you have any agent friend who promote to you overseas project, you also run away and delete them from your contact list. Especially UK property. Yeah, ha, ha, ha. I hope this video will help you. It is a fun video, but it is not fun if you are one of the buyers. I am very glad that this member who came to me directly for one-to-one -one consultation told me he did not proceed with the agent friend. And I told him for the 1.5 million budget, you can easily buy a two bed, two bath, very new city fringe condo, or even a three bedroom in OCR. And whatever rental that you collect can cover your money installment. And plus there will be some capital gains in three years. It's a very low risk investment because in these two areas, OCR and city fringe, there are always buyers. Once there's always buyers, price will go up as well. You can share what are the projects you felt that you buy, you chew immediately. You buy is like punching your hockey over and over again. So what are the projects? Let me hear your views by commenting below in the comment section. So guys, I hope you don't make any mistake because once you make a mistake in property investment, you will lose an arm, kicked out by your parents. So do subscribe to my YouTube channel and you continue to learn. See you in my next video.